All right, boys, so new FL Studio update has just dropped and you know the drill we're gonna be checking it out today in this video. We got a new name, new features, new plugins. It's gonna be a good time. Let's get into it. So it is called FL Studio 2024. When you open it up, you are greeted with this brand new FL Studio screen. It's kind of like when you open up Photoshop and you're greeted with like this, the menu to like pick a project or something from before, which is kind of cool. So we've got our recent projects here and we can start a new project from a bunch of different templates and stuff, which is pretty interesting as well. But we're just going to go for simple, basic, whatever. So this is the new plugin. It's called Kepler XO. I'm not sure what type of synth it's based on, but it is a synth plugin. FL Studio, I've definitely stepped up their stock plugins in recent years so i'm definitely interested to check this one out gotta get that dark theme of course ah presets up here of course they are yeah it's giving me like juno vibes let's keep that sound there and let's move on to the next feature and that is the new chord progression tool ah here we go Oh, wow. Okay. So yeah, this is the new chord progression screen. This would be really useful to kind of like explore some new progressions and stuff. It has like a dice roll feature, which is really interesting. And obviously presets too. Oh, here we go. Let's see what we can do. Maybe we can get a nice chord progression here. Oh, wow. That them first three chords were crazy. So that's a Metro Boomin type shit. That's hard. What? What key is it? I don't even know. Is it B minor? Wait, it literally said, didn't it? It literally, was it all P? Yeah, all P. Oh, and it syncs up with, oh, it's B major. Oh, so you can do alternative chords in there as well. You can move them around and shit. This is mad, bro. What? This is really cool, you know. You can just keep generating them as well. That's, man, okay. Ah, oh, yes. Okay, now we're talking. So if I change the key here, B minor, let's go G sharp minor. Generate. That's also quite nice. Yeah, that's nice, you know. Damn, this is actually going to force me to try out some new chord progressions and maybe learn some as well. That's really cool. It's just Alt P as well, and it just brings it up, and you can just real quick just generate chords. Pick up FL Studio with that one, because that's really, really good. So let's put this in a mixer channel. I want to try out this new effect plugin, and it's called Spreader, and it's like a stereo imager type plugin. Oh, that sounds sick. It's really spread it around, made it a lot more stereo. That makes it sound so much more big and wide. Man, that's sick. Okay, let's get a chorus on this. Yeah. I like that. That's nice. Okay, so let's expand on this idea before we test out any new features. We're going to be using sounds from my Essence of Trap kit, which you guys can get right now. The link is down below in the description. Basically, it's got 2,000 sounds in it that can help you make way better melodies in a fifth of the time. It's a no-brainer, man. Check it out. It's currently on sale. Link down below. All right, we need a bass. We can now test out another new effect plugin, which is called Low Lifter. All these new plugins so far have been really, really useful. Definitely worth updating for 100%. Um, but let's keep adding to this then. Let's get an ARP. I really, I'm hearing an ARP on this. Yeah, that's, that's really nice. I really like a Metro Boomin type vibe on this. So I'm just going to pursue that idea. Okay, I like that. I feel like this chord progression and this do not go together anymore. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use that chord feature again. So I want something dark. Is there a dark option?
Ja, yeah, jeg er spændt op. I like that. I'm gonna do some Metro Star drums on this one, so we're gonna go into my MPC drum kit. Get the Metro chant in there. Oh, this is a nice day. Wait. It's like I want like a faster melody, like a dun 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 dun. Literally something like this. Should we do a key change? Oh yeah, that's flipping hard. What is that? Right, I'm gonna make a little intro section real quick. I'm gonna just have that as like our pre-drop type thing, but I'm gonna start with the chords. Repeat. Oh, you can do it a lot quicker now. What? That's actually fire. Oh, fire. Get a little percussion loop. Little riser in there as well, basically done. Stem out the drum pattern real quick. So that's basically the video done. The only feature I haven't really talked about is the features inside of FL Cloud because I don't have an FL Cloud subscription. It's not something I would use. Everything else has been covered and I love the new features in FL Studio 2024 and I think you guys will as well. So if you guys want to get the Essence of Trap, link down below in the description. It's the kit I use to make the melodies in this beat. It's got a bunch of sounds in there you can use to make crazy melodies and uh, it's a lot of fun. So check it out. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a great day. Peace.